Go ahead and introduce yourself. Hi, uh, Tom Cummins, President of San Antonio AFL CIO. Oh. And we're here representing all the unions uh, in San Antonio. All of us support the work of the letter carriers and the postal workers. The post office is a part of the Constitution. And to attack that is to attack our Constitution. And we're here today, and we're not going to stand for it. Awesome. We'll be out in November to vote, and we're going to vote anyone who's done that support. Better carriers and the postal workers. Sounds perfect. Okay. My Homer? name is Homer Hernandez, and I'm with the National Association of Letter Carriers. We are asking the public to go ahead and call their senators and demand to pass these bills to bring the postal service back to its stronger position than we were before. Vote by mail, I just want to talk about vote by mail. Vote by mail is very important to the community and to the country. We tell you that we take pride as letter carriers and postal workers on jobs we do for the country. We are just a service. We provide a service. So those that uh, uh, believe that we do not do our jobs correctly, uh, do your job before you send it through the postal service and we will deliver and give you the best service we can. Vote by mail is secure and it is safe and the letter carriers take pride on, on what we do. So please support the letter carriers and, and call your senators and get them to demand these uh, pass these bills. Absolutely. Robert? Hey, just like, like Homer said, call your senator, let them know that pass the HEROES Act. It's not only for us, it's for all first responders. Call your senators and let them know to pass the HEROES Act. Thank you. Okay, guys, before you go, one other thing. What do you think about this uh, congressional hearing that uh, DeJoy was at? Does anyone know what the status is on this issue? Well, we just heard that uh, he was subpoenaed to give up some more information about why he was delaying the mail, and so far he hasn't complied, and so hopefully he will comply with the subpoena from Congress, and he'll get out that information to him to show that he is delaying the mail. Right now in our, in our plant right here, there's still machines that are unplugged, and they're just sitting in the middle of the workroom floor. It looks like a salvage area. So you need to get those machines back together and get them, get them working for this upcoming mail season and this upcoming uh, ballot season, all right? Awesome. Thank you, guys.